Hi guys, welcome to Adam at Collar TV. I'm Adam France are through to the final of Euro 2016 in their own backyard. They'll take on Portugal in Paris on Sunday in what is going to be a fantastic game. At least I hope so and at least I hope it was good as a game today. I was watching it on a stream on the way back from Wimbledon so I didn't get the best view of it of course. The stream was up and down lagging. I got back in for the last half an hour. So I do know what happened, I do know the main part, and I'll speak about the main part. The first thing, the handball for the penalty, it was a definite handball. I've seen people on Twitter trying to argue this. No, it wasn't a penalty, it was a penalty, it wasn't. Definitely was. Guys, if that was against us, we'd want a penalty. We'd be screaming for a penalty. Basti, I love you, mate, but that was a penalty, and rightly so, the referee gave it. What is his hand doing up in that position? It just doesn't make sense. And even though it was ball to hand, his hand shouldn't have been there and it was a penalty and the referee rightly give it. Griezmann sticks it in the net, 1-0 to France at half time. Germany didn't deserve to be behind at the break to be fair to them, but they were in the second half as well. Neuer makes a mistake which gives Griezmann the opportunity to score the second goal. France were better in that second half, probably deserved to go through to the final. Germany will be gutted because they had a fantastic team there as world champions. They went into this tournament as one of the favourites and they haven't made it to the final. Of course, coming up against France, who were one of the other favourites. And for me, the favourites in the tournament, they'll go into the final as favourites as well because they have got a fantastic team. Antoine Griezmann's on six goals now, six goals in the tournament. His top goal scorer at the minute, Cristiano Ronaldo's behind him on four. So Cristiano Ronaldo needs to score a hat-trick just to beat Griezmann and that's if Griezmann doesn't score. So I think it's safe to say Griezmann has got the top scorer but will he be lifting that trophy on Sunday? That one still remains to be seen. I think France will go into it as favourites, rightly so. I predicted them to lift the trophy and I still think they will but I really want Cristiano Ronaldo to do it. If Cristiano Ronaldo can do that getting international honours under his belt, playing for a team that isn't amazing. Yes, they've got the odd good player, but when you're coming up against the likes of Spain, Germany, France, even Italy and Cole, Portugal aren't on them levels. So if Ronaldo can do it with Portugal, that's a fantastic achievement for them. Um, and I really want him to do it. I just don't think he will. And it might end in tears for Ronaldo. We saw Griezmann against Ronaldo in the Champions League finally. It obviously ended in tears for Griezmann, but will Griezmann get his moment in France at the Euros? It would be beautiful for him, wouldn't it? After that dreadful performance, um, after that dreadful result for him in the Champions League final, um, to then go and do this top goal scorer for his nation, in their nation, at the European Championships, as they go on to win it, that would be amazing for him and he'd fully deserve it because he's been phenomenal in recent years. So. Well done to him. Deservedly top goal scorer. I predicted it as well. Oh, wish I put some money on it, but I didn't. Anyway, guys, thank you for joining me today. It's been a bit short and sweet because I didn't obviously get to see the whole of the game properly. So I don't feel I can really talk about it that much. But from what I have seen, that's what I can say. Why I didn't see it? Because I was at Wimbledon on my way back. And of course, as I promised, you guys will get a vlog of that as well. I'm going to edit it tonight, so I may be up all night. I'm absolutely shattered. But I'll try and get it done, get it up in the morning. So guys, hit that subscribe button. If you haven't as well, hit the notifications button because as soon as I upload a video, you'll get it there first. We're over 22k subs now. First, Thank you to everyone that subscribed. And if you haven't, help us push closer to that 25k. But thank you for joining me here today. France are through to the final. What do you think about that? Who was your man of the match today? Was it a penalty? What the hell was Nua doing? I know David De Gea is better than him and he's only second best in the world but still he shouldn't be making those mistakes and he makes a lot of mistakes to be fair. Is it because of the way he plays that old sweeper keeper kind of thing? Even though today you can't blame that for the mistake he made. It was his horrible handling. But anyway, let us know what you think about the game today. In the comments below, who's going to win that final? Griezmann versus Ronaldo, France against Portugal. Should be a good one. Hit your comments in below and I'll see you later.